Hello everyone, welcome back to High Mathematics, really interesting geometrical problem, problem right here. We need to find this x, we need to find this side of this square. Right here we have right here 12, this line 3, this line 9, right here we have 90 degrees angles, so we need to find our x. How can we do this? I want to start with this one, take a look closely. If we rewrite this element right here in the, in the middle of this square, I want to write it right here. So we have this line, we have right here 90 degrees. And right here we have this line. So this line is this from, from middle. Okay, what did it give us? Right here we have 12, this line give us 3, and this line give us 9. Of course this, nine, this angles 90 degrees. So this is line from this, from this middle. But what are we going to do next? I want to show you that if we right here, if we connect these dots in the end of this line, so this line, we will have a really interesting case because we can easily solve that if we write this line right here instead of this and if we write this line. If we still have 90 degrees and this line give us 3 and this one is equal to 3 and moreover this line equal to 9 and this one equal to 9 and this line equal to 9 and if you look closely 12 plus 9 all this line will be equal to 21. And I'm going to write it, it, this element in another way. So right here we have 90 degrees, right here we have a, this side. What we will have? We will have this bottom line 21, right here 3, and right here this line. And we need to find this line in the middle, which connect these, these two points. So let's find it. Of course, as you can see, this is a classic Pythagorean theorem right here, because you can easily find it using this theorem. This equal to this square, 21 square, plus 3 square, which is equal to square root of 450. And moreover, we can simplify this a little bit. We can write it as 2 times 225, which is equal to 15 square root of 2. This is our, this is our answer. But how it help us to find our x? Because we find only this diagonal of this square root. Of this square because if we connect this point and this point we find a diagonal of our of our square but how can we find our side our x of course if we have a square if we have a square with the diagonal which is equal to 15 square root of 2 in this square we will have x and x is, is the same the same it's equal to each other and moreover we have 90 degrees angle so this is the same case as right here, we have a triangle, so we can use the Pythagorean theorem right here, we will have this square plus this square, so x square plus x square equal to 15 square root of 2 squared. And how can we solve it? Of course, we have that our x square plus x square will be equal to 2x square equal to 15 square root of 2 square. And if we take root from both of the side, we will have that our x square root of 2 equal to 15 square root of 2. So it signals out that right here we have that our x equal to, we cancel this square root of 2, x equal to 15 is our, is our solution, is the side of if this square x equal to 15 is our solution. What do you think about this solution? What is your what is your approach, how you solve it, it will be really studied it. And of course, thank you so much for watching, for your support, for your subscribing, I really appreciate it. It helps me a lot, it inspires me a lot to make new interesting content. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos. Have a great day and thank you for your support.